Come on, boys! Hoopla! Not a bad idea. Baby, I love the way you do. Madame Lorelei winks knowingly at Gabriel and twitches her head. Yep, she wants me. This is the last. Gabriel examines the veil with a magnifying glass. That sequin looks a little strange. Why, it's a snake scale! The fortune teller's veil is studded with sequins. Gabriel carefully uses the tweezers to remove the snake scale from the veil. Gabriel magnifies the scale from the fortune teller. The iridescent scale is hued olive green. It doesn't seem to match the scale from Lake Pontchartrain. I think this veil belongs to you. Huh, my veil. I'm always losing those things. You have no idea. Well, darling, you're such a sweetie to return a lady who's delicate and so handsome as well. Well, I... And since you have such a clear interest in fortune telling, let me see your hands. They look so strong. Perhaps they will make both our fortunes clear, no? I wish something would. Hmm, strong. Yes, no. yet so delicate and uh, flexible. <sighs> you don't know the half of it. Oh, good. I see a mysterious woman in your immediate future. Madame Lorelei winks at Gabriel knowingly. She is a dangerous woman. Dark and beautiful. Ah, I see the road of your life falling. And very soon. <laughs> the blood drains from Madame Lorelei's face in an instant. Sweat beads on her upper lip. Are you okay? <laughs> oh. oh God! Beware! Beware! What is it about me lately? How's it going today? What? Oh, it's only you. Man, I have been jumpy all day. That that pattern of yours really freaked me out for some reason. There's just something creepy. You finished it? Yeah, and you're welcome to it. Here. Wow, this is great. Uh-huh. Just don't, like, blow up the planet with it or something, okay? I didn't mean to upset you. Oh, forget it. I'm probably just being stupid. Do your thing with it, and good luck.
I knew you'd miss me, so I came back. Oh boy, party time. Got a minute, Grace? What's up? Could you do some research for me? Sure, what? I have a pattern I need you to research. How interesting. What is it? It's a reconstruction of the tracings they found around the murder victims. The ones done in flour and blood. Ugh! You shouldn't carry this kind of thing around. Who knows what these symbols mean? Well, wear your evil banishing gloves if you want. But check it out for me, would you? I'll see what I can find out. Anything else? I can't think of anything. Okay. I've got some things I need to do. Uh-huh. Hi. I have a hundred dollars. You still want to sell that crocodile mask? That's a hundred dollars. Sure enough. The mask, it's yours, sir. Here you go. Careful it don't bite you now. Yeah, thanks. Don't you go forgetting your Lagnia. A free bottle of master gambling oil. The sign said I could get Lady Luck oil instead. Well, I wasn't thinking a man as young as you would be needing that kind of remedy. But if you are having problems with your... Oh, that's all right. Believe me, I don't need it. I'll just stick with this. Thanks, anyway. <laughs> of course, it ain't none of my business if you do need it. I don't need it. Of course you don't. <laughs>